Okay, everyone, good morning. It is day 18. Our PCT adventure is uh, old enough to vote now. So um, we're at mile 186.28, something like that, 186 something. Um, uh, no real plan for today, just all, it should be all downhill. Still heading out of the mountains. I don't think we'll reach the desert floor today. I don't think so. Um, a lot of downhill. We're still really, here I'll show you. We're still really high up. You can see the city down there. The other one's behind the trees there. Um, you can kind of see Dad in the campsite back there. Mine was right there last night. Um, it was actually pretty warm last night. The last two nights, or three nights, we've had trouble keeping our feet warm in our sleeping bags, which is like insanely rare for me and Dad because we both run really warm and our feet are almost always warm. And... Uh, Last three nights up until t tonight, um, or last night, we uh, couldn't keep our feet feet warm. So we were look, thinking about getting um, some of those little like down down booties you put on your feet at night. But uh, last night was a lot warmer. It didn't really get cold cold until like the morning. So that was nice to to sleep warm. I've been sleeping in pretty much everything the last three nights because we've been up so high, and sleeping in my puffy too. And I was able to take my puffy off last night and my. Uh, beanie off so it was nice to have a little bit warmer night so no set plan for miles today a lot of downhill it's going to be rough on the knees but better than all the climbing yesterday we're still we haven't decided about water we're light on water um i think we're seven miles from the next water but there's also a water source like less than maybe half a mile three quarters of a mile behind us but it's up a bunch of switchbacks we came down last night and i'd rather not go back up there unless we absolutely have to but uh um, we don't know if there's going to be water some, no, somewhere before seven miles. I would think with all the snow melt, like we found water just off the trail that we scooped off the trail yesterday and used. So I would think with all the snow melt, we passed two streams um, late last night, that on down the trail we'd find something before seven miles. But, you know, so then we're still undecided on what we're going to do there. But that is the plan for today, just as far down the hill as we can get. Um, the farther we get, <clears throat> the shorter the day is into... Cabanzano, so if we can do a good amount today, then we could possibly go into Cabanzano tomorrow. If we get a lower amount today, then we'd have probably one more full day, and then the third day we'd be going into Cabanzano where they've got uh, Dollar General. We need to resupply. Excited about that because it'd be the cheapest resupply. We've we've resupplied in trail towns and it's been really expensive, so that would be a lot cheaper. They also have a In-N-Out Burger, and next to the In-N-Out Burger is a Chipotle, and next to the Chipotle is a Starbucks. So. Also heard there's like a Panda Express. We got Taco Bell. We got all kinds of options if we can get Hitch in there. But that's two days or three days down the down the line. So yeah, we're gonna finish packing up and head down trail. Let's go. small joys of through hiking we walked through all that snow yesterday so my shoes got wet and my socks got wet and then by the time we found camp it was barely any sun so really not enough to dry them so they kind of dried but not really especially not the gingies the blue ones the toe socks there um they're super wet so i'm waiting for the last possible minute and then switching out of my sleep socks putting them in my pack and putting freezing cold socks on luckily my shoes dried pretty good in the night they're all kind of crusty but they're not they're not too wet but those socks are gonna be nice and cold Nice. 
go recommend. About a three out of ten. And I think they smell about five times worse. Wet. First chance we have sunshine, I gotta dry these socks out. <laughs> Feel like a glove kind of morning? Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep them on for a little bit. We're gonna be in the shadows for... I think my solar battery pack came unplugged halfway through the day yesterday. Halfway through yesterday? Halfway through the day, I think my solar oh. panel came unplugged from the battery. Yeah. So I went to pull it out and it wasn't plugged in. I'm like, gosh dang it. Not that we were in a ton of sun, but... And we've got three and two. Cool. Note to buyer. Yeah. Next time we resupply, those dark chocolate Milky Way are far superior. Oh, I love those. To the normal if they're available. Those are my favorite candy bar. I didn't know if you'd that like them or not. I have never had one before. Oh, so wow. good. I think they're my number one favorite candy bar of all time. We figured the food's pretty close too. Yep. How much do you have left? I think I've got a thing of mashed potatoes. I think I still have one thing of chicken. I might have a thing of tuna too. Oh, we're okay. We have to spend one more night before the water goes out. We I think we'll get to the highway today, haven't we? No, it's 22. Oh, is it 22 miles? Yeah. Oh, wow. I didn't think it was that far. Yeah. I don't even know what to do here.
So we came across this little campground about three miles in. We started, I think, at 8. It's like 11 or after that. So it was slow going this morning um, through all the sloshy, slippery, whatever snow, about a, about a mile an hour. So hopefully that kind of snows behind us. But I got my shoes and socks finally drying out on that log. And we put snow in our knock bladders. I don't know if you can see. I had a closer picture, but over there, um, snow is melting, going through the sawyer and filling up my bottle. It's about three quarters full, almost all the way full. Dad's doing the same with his. Feet are finally dried out. I kind of felt something funny yesterday when uh, we were walking through all the wet snow and then had miles afterwards and if you're squeamish look away first blister right there so it doesn't hurt we'll just have to doctor it up tonight so we're getting ready to head out back down the pct hopefully a lot smoother i think it's up that way somewhere um should be pretty much all downhill and hopefully less and less snow as we get lower so that's the plan. We're back on the PCT. And no snow so far. All right. We're hoping there's water in just a couple miles. We melted some snow, but didn't get much more than like half a liter. So we're hoping there's snow up here. Dad brought a little in his knock. So get a little out of that if not. After that, I think it's like seven miles or more to the next reliable water. But the latest far out on this one close, far out comment on this one close says uh, drive, but it's from before the snow. So fingers crossed, it's got some water. So the last one was good. Holy Look at that. We're we'll going down fast. There's not much mountain left. roll wow how dare you how dare you i think we're gonna call those two spots home for the night i hope it's not too windy a little view of san jacinto there mountains over here yeah nice 
Okay, end of day 18, I believe. We're at mile 197.2. I think that puts us at 10.6 or 10.4 or something like that for the day. Um, a lot of decline, a lot of um, snow in the morning. We've slid multiple times. I think I fell all the way down like four times and then previously slid, slid down on the ice like six times. So slow going the first three miles I think took us uh, almost three hours. Um, so a windy here. Hopefully you can hear me. Um, so then we did the last seven plus all downhill. Um, so we're gonna hit mile 200 tomorrow. So that's exciting. Three more miles, and then I think it's like 10. So we'll just see where we get. If uh, we don't get down there tomorrow, then we will uh, wait and hitch in the next day. Maybe sleep under the bridge or somewhere there close. Um, if we make good time in the morning, then maybe we go in um, to Cabin Zano tomorrow. I, we'll just play it by ear and see how it goes. But another long, tiring day, a lot of downhill, a lot of snow. So, yeah, but we made it. in that time um, so yeah i think that's it so thanks for following along and we will talk to you guys tomorrow